family belonged to Indiana has decided to stake against vaccination, they didn't do vaccination for their child. But now they had realized that their decision was wrong, and they wondered on knowing the flu shot. If they vaccinate the child with this flu shot, then their child would have been solved now. The three-year-old girl named Ayla BLU died on Monday morning in her home in Muncie, Indiana and this incident happened after the diagnosis of the child. The grandmother of the child Tama Shidler has stated that their family had decided second time not to do vaccination to the child. Shidler also added that the parents of Ayla Bio have heard that the flu shot vaccination is not that much effective and so they have rejected to vaccinate the child with the flu shot. The WRTV which was affiliated with the ABC has interviewed with Schittler on Monday to know more about this incident. In that interview, Schittler said they told us that it doesn't matter if the flu had spread around the body and Bela Bile had not vaccinated the child with the flu shot. By knowing that it won't help to save the child hereafter, we didn't allow to inject those chemicals into the child body. She also added that the sayings of anyone or nothing could bring back their child to them hereafter. Schittler also said that they have also planned about the celebration of the fourth birthday of Ayla Bile coming month and they also completed all the formality to join her for a coming preschool year. Ayla Bia has been taken to the local clinic on Tuesday by their family, and while taking her to the clinic, Ayla Bia has a very high temperature which was about 106 degrees. The clinic tested the child and found that she is affected by influenza and after that, they had sent the child to the Ball Memorial Hospital. Their Ayla Bile stayed in the emergency room for three days. After three days, the doctor felt that her body condition is doing better and so they sent back Ayla Bile to her home. But unfortunately, she was passed away on Monday morning while sleeping. Schittler said that the last night she ate Cheerios and she walked, and they don't know how these things can happen. But the exact reason for Ayla Bile's death was not able to find till now. While asking about this incident to some representatives of the Ball Memorial Hospital which was the last hospital treated for Ayla Bile, they said that are not supposed to discuss the details of any patient, and they conveyed their hearty condolence for the family of Ayla Bile. The death of Ayla Bile is one of the battles of the nation against the brutal flu, and it outbreaks this record. The U.S. Centers for Disease Control and Prevention said that about 14,676 people have been attacked by this flu and made hospitalized. This number of the person attacked by this flu has doubled in the count when compared to last year. Regarding CDC 63 children were died at present because of this influenza and this makes to do vaccination who hadn't vaccinated till now.